Hello, hello. Welcome back again for another video, you guys. Thank you so much for joining me here today. I am Cristola for Jesus. And I what I do here is share dreams and visions from the Lord. That is my job. That is what God has uh, sent me here to do. So this is what we are doing. Um, I This video was emailed to me. I don't know if this is actual channel of the person or not. I don't think, I think they actually just suggested this video to me because it was really good. And it is Mary Kay Baxter's uh, um, Visions of the Tribulation and the Rapture, I believe. So we're gonna go ahead and watch this and see. Um, this is a little bit longer of a video. And uh, so let's let's check it out and see what, uh, what she experienced. Because I think it's been a long time since I've actually watched one of these from her. I don't know if I've watched this exact one, but uh, yeah, let's get into it, you guys. The end time mm -hmm. vision a, man, a woman had that goes with my testimony. Mm -hmm. And what I saw was in the end times of twofold revelation, I saw when the church was captured, caught out, okay? Mm -hmm. And then I saw the world and the American flag was burned, cracked and burned. And I saw army troops all over the world. Mm -hmm. I saw army trucks come in and, and uh, with guns and barracoot, you know, these Whoa. all kind of stuff and putting people in uh, big trucks, taking them to places to be tormented. Mm -hmm. I saw people with marks on their head, three sixes up here, mm -hmm. and are either on their hand. Mm -hmm. And the peoples that would not take the mark were beheaded in big mm -hmm. gallet with their heads chopped off. I saw awful, awful things on the face of this earth. Mm -hmm. I saw um, beasts that look like part man and part beast walking around mm -hmm. that people need to get ready for the coming of the Lord. Yes. The Word of God is coming to pass very quickly. Yes. And it's not to put the fear into people uh, that God will smush them. It's to let them know God expects us to turn to Him and turn from our sins mm -hmm. with, a, you know, with truth and righteousness and let Him clean up our lives. Yes, and yes. He will help us, Pastor. Mm -hmm. He will help us overcome mm -hmm. everything. Yes. And He loves us. Jesus loves us. Mm -hmm. And people need to know the love of God, yeah. but yet they need to know what's coming on the earth. And mm -hmm. he promised that he would let us foreknow things coming on the face of the earth. Yeah. And if he could share that for yes. a few minutes. Now, there's a scripture said that pray always that you might escape these things that's coming upon the earth, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. This sister, I gave this book to his uh, husband. I led to the Lord. He was on one of our videos, Brother Thomas. And mm -hmm. uh, we led him to the Lord about four years ago. His wife got saved too. And I gave them the book and they read it and immediately after they began to read the book, it shook them up so much. The next night the sister went to bed and immediately she said she woke up in his dream, in her dream. In her dream, she woke up and her and her husband was looking for their little kids. They have two children. And she woke up looking for them, but she couldn't find them. And she woke up her husband in the dream and he looked, they ran outside and once they ran outside, it was other individuals running outside also looking for their kids too. And she said she looked up in the air and she seen hundreds of thousands of people, most of them was kids though, going up in the air. Mm. And the voice said, this is the rapture, they're taking mm. away. She saw wow. all of a sudden out of nowhere, just like your vision, Ms. Max, she said, the army trucks begin to come all over America and begin to bum rush the territories in the city, all different cities, and they took trucks and began to take people out of their household mm. and put them in these trucks. They mm. took them to these buildings, remind her of, a, a, she said, of an aid office where you receive yes. uh, financial aid yes. or whatever the situation might be. And she said they would sit them down and begin to yes, tell them I that you the must take thing. this mark. Mm -hmm. If you don't take this mark, that you are going to be killed. And she said she's seen a group of people running around saying they was Christian. They began to praise the Lord and chant, Jesus is Lord. And the more they began to chant, Jesus was Lord, they began to snatch them off in different rooms. And she said she heard them being tormented in different rooms, crying and hollering and screaming out Jesus. She said, Lord, well, wait a minute. I'm a Christian. What am I doing here? He said, I, I pray to you. I, I was in your word. And she said, the voice spoke back to her and said, the reason you're here, Mickey, is because you didn't preach my word. Hmm. She said, well, Lord, why is my husband here? He said, the reason your husband is here, because he had unforgiveness in his heart. Mm -hmm. I would like for y'all to know there's many people right now that's Christian mm -hmm. that have unforgiveness in their heart. Some that against a brother or sister, some that against a mother or father, some that know the word of God, they go to church every Sunday, but they're afraid to preach the gospel. Okay. Mm -hmm. She said from there, she be, they let her go to the washroom area. And she said they gave them three minutes to do what they had to do. She said that the water would come on, and then the water come on, people was washing their hairs, and ladies got soap in her eyes, and she began to cry that she wanted to take the mark because she couldn't get the soap out of her water immediately cut off. Mm -hmm. Mickey told her, you can have my water. And from there, 
She said, don't take the mark. She came back out and she seen a special bulletin on the TV bedding in the wall like a hospital room. And on the television set, it was a special bulletin that came on. It was a man with a sneaky smile talking about, yes, uh, hundreds of people, a thousand all over missing all over the nation. Could this be the rapture? He was sarcastic. Could this be Jesus coming back? He said, nah, I doubt it. He said, wait a minute, let's have a word for my president. She said, all of a sudden, she seen the president. And this time, Bush hadn't lost when she had this dream. Bush hadn't lost the presidency, but she said it wasn't Bush. She said the Lord covered up his face. And the only thing she seen was his hand and heard his voice. And he was lying to the public. And everybody was buying it. She said all of a sudden they snatched her up. They told her come. And they began to march down a single line down this tunnel. Mm -hmm. And this tunnel they was walking through, she heard voices of different individuals crying and screaming out to Jesus. Jesus, have mercy, Lord. I love you. I love you. I'm going to die for you, Jesus. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. And just get cut off. She said wow. she began to march down the stream and she seen at the other end of the tunnel there was hundreds of them going across. She said when they got over to the other building, it was a whole room of guillotines. Mm. And the guillotine, people was actually getting their hairs cut off. Mm. She said the people that was taking the mark of the beast, when they took it on their right hand, they immediately peer, appeared on their forehead. Yes. And she said, you can see that thing in the mm. spirit and in the physical. Yes. She said, you can mm -hmm. see it. She said, when she walked over towards the next building, she seen a whole bunch of people. She said, people thought they was regular human beings, but they was really demon spirits. Yes. They had black capes on, mm. hoods over their face, but their eyes was like demon eyes, and their hands was made out of snake skin, like you said about the heart of hell. Yes. She said, with snake skin, these, these demons was cold-blooded killers. And the Lord spoke and said, that's what my word means when it said, war unto the habitants on the earth, the Satan that came amongst you with great mm. wrath because he knows time is short. Mm. This is demon spirit mm. manifesting the flesh, mm. act like people, but they have the heart to kill people. And she said they began to take people and turn their head off. The and they chopped her and her husband's head off and her spirit immediately went up into the heaven. Wow. The following testimonies are to keep the video as short as possible. You will find the link to the original video in the description below. <gasps> Okay, where is it? Let me check. Oh, I don't see it. Let's overcome everything. But I can look it up. Let's see. Whoa, did you guys see that? That was crazy. All the dreams that we've been having and experiencing are like bits and clips. And this is like, they're having it all, all of it together, you know, like encompassed together, like the rapture and then the war and the American flag going down. Man, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it was how it was going to go down. Hang on. I'm going to look at the... I'm going to look for something here. You don't have to go to hell. You don't have to go. No, Jesus wants to set us free. Yes, yes. Amen. Amen. We want the Lord to lead, sister, and to lead through you, just uh, whichever way you want. Come in and, and uh, with guns and barracuda, you know, these all kind of stuff, and putting people in uh, big trucks, taking them to places to be tormented. Mm -hmm. I saw people with marks on their head, three sixes up here, mm -hmm. and are either on their hand. Mm -hmm. And the people that would not take the mark were beheaded in big mm -hmm. gallant with their heads chopped off. I saw awful, awful things on the face of this earth. Mm -hmm. I saw um, beasts that looked like part man and part beast walking around. Mm -hmm. And Jameson shared with me today, another lady had a similar vision, a young Christian. Mm -hmm. And I would, if we had the proper time, it goes with this, what's happening today, mm -hmm. that people need to get ready for the coming of the Lord. Yes. The Word of God is coming to pass very quickly. Yes. And it's not to put the fear into people uh, that God will smush them. It's to let them know God wow. expects us to turn to Him and turn from our sins mm -hmm. with, a, you know, with truth and righteousness and let Him clean up our lives. Yeah. Glory to God. Wow. That's crazy, you guys. And that, that, well, I was watching that, uh, <laughs> I was watching that video recently of, um, 
this guy last days last days and uh he talked about the rapture too recently last days his his video's been uh yeah this guy right here i watched this video i know everybody's been watching this video and he had that dream crazy experience of the tribulation and um of course it's got to be a commercial <laughs> okay Let's get through this commercial really quick. Sorry, you guys can hear my baby in the background. So he had a dream and it's like exactly the same thing, you know, like wars coming to America and he experiences the same kinds of things. The mark of the beast, the guys in the masks, you know, that's so crazy. Like all of our dreams equal that dream, but like from that lady that we just watched. That was crazy. She saw everything in one dream and what he, ex what he was talking about too, this guy, like what he experienced is like, are all of our dreams that are like snippet clippets combined together, equaling their dreams. That's crazy. Oh man. I love you guys. If you guys made it to the end of this video, I want you to leave down below in the comments. Um, Leave down below some green hearts and uh, Acts 2.17. <laughs> in the last days, I will pour my spirit on all flesh and your sons and daughters shall prophesy. That's amazing. God bless you guys. I hope you're having a blessed day in the Lord Jesus. If you want to send in your dream or vision, you can send it to shareforcrystal at gmail.com for the end times. If you want to have fellowship, you can join my Discord here. And uh, the link's always in the description box. You can join the Discord, have fellowship with us. And uh, yeah, I love you guys. And I'll see you guys again soon in the next one. Bye.